hey guys welcome to my channel so in this video i'm going to show you something really cool okay so i was at a party one of my friends party and he's a narcissist he used to use instagram a lot so what i did was in order to surprise him so everybody was decorating you know balloons and all this stuff but what i did is he got a really nice 4k monitor and he used to post a lot of pictures on instagram i knew this so in this example i'm not going to show his id because you know it's a privacy invasion according to you so i'm going to use my brother's id so let me go to in this directory surprise which i created and i will install this tool insta loader and this is a tool uh, which you can use in order to fetch anything from the instagram so insta loader and then login box writer i will log in as a box writer and then no meta data json meta data json all right so i don't want any json metadata because by default it gives no caption again by default it gives and have in v for no video i don't want any video all right so the use the username is this this is my brother's username uh, of his instagram you can follow him if you want so let's press enter and now as you can see i already entered the password so my se session is saved so it's not going to ask for login again and it's downloading all the stuff now i downloaded this before so it's going to happen pretty quickly because i don't want to waste time so as you can see it finished but usually it took five uh, five minutes at least so as you can see i got all the pictures just pictures there is nothing else instead of this uh, file which always get created for some reason so now what i can do is i can use my yt play to where is my mind uh, mr robot audio uh, this is the music which i want to play in the background so to set the mood so mpv no video file loop file okay i want to loop this file because i don't want the music to stop and i want to run everything in the background so end for running it everything in the background so now i hope the music is running all right so it gives some glitch sometimes but it is going to run in the background so now what i can do is i can type um ls and then asterisk dot jpeg this is just going to give me all the jpg files and nothing else and now i can just pipe it into shuff to shuffle all the files and now i can pipe all of this into sxiv and sxiv is a really amazing image viewer and let me show you why because you can just input all the you know whatever the image files you're piping you can input into sxiv via this all right so you can also type this b for hiding the border which you get in the bottom of sxiv and capital s for giving a delay time of you know of three seconds i guess okay three seconds are cool and i also want to do full screen so f is for full screen so let's press enter and as you can see it's full screen everything is so it's it's like a it's like a screensaver okay built on top of somebody's instagram so as you can see my brother got a life unlike me so this is cool i mean yeah i i just love it like you can do so much thanks for that sxiv sxiv is really cool so thanks for watching this video